A 30 drone operation video tutorial, product list, charging demonstration. Insert the charging cable into the battery charging port and connect the other end to the power supply. The battery indicator light indicates that it is charging and the full charge indicator light remains on constantly. Insert the charging cable into the charging port of the remote control and connect the other end to the power supply. The remote control indicator light flashes as a prompt and the full indicator light remains constantly on. Preparations before flight. Insert the battery. Remove the joystick and install the remote control joystick. The remote control time needs to be calibrated before takeoff. Open the settings. Click on the internet to connect to WIFI or a mobile phone hotspot. After a successful connection, go to the system options below the menu. Find the date and time options. Enable the automatic time. Settings of the remote control time calibration has been completed. Insert the SD card. Extend the arm of the unmanned aerial vehicle. Remove the pantal protective cover. Place the drone on a horizontal ground. First, briefly press the switch, then long press it until all the lights are constantly on to turn on the drone. Automatic calibration of the drone gimbal. Press the remote control switch briefly and then long. The indicator light will flash and remain bright for a long time, indicating that the remote control has been turned off. The front light of the drone remains on for a long time, and the rear light flashes slowly to complete the automatic frequency alignment. After the frequency alignment is successful, open the app interface and the connection is successful. Press and hold the one key calibration ground magnetic field for a long time. The remote control will make a beeping sound and the front and rear lights will flash quickly. Pick up the drone. Rotate the drone counterclockwise in the horizontal direction. A beep sound indicates successful calibration. If the front lights are flashing and the rear lights remain on, the level calibration is successful. Rotate the drone counterclockwise in the vertical direction. A beep sound indicates successful calibration. If the front lights remain on continuously and the rear lights flash slowly, the vertical calibration is successful. Reposition the drone on a horizontal ground and the gimbal will automatically straighten. Press the one key gyroscope correction button briefly and the remote control will beep. If the front and rear lights flash quickly and the front light remains on for a long time, while the rear light flashes slowly, the calibration is successful. Place it in an open area to search for GPS signals. It can fly when there are more than nine satellites. Keep the front lights on continuously and the rear lights flashing slowly until they turn blue and remain on continuously, indicating that the GPS search is complete. Use the outer eight joysticks, unlock the motor, and push the joystick up to take off the drone. Rise, decline, left rotation, rotate right, move forward, retreat, fly to the left, fly on the right side. Turn the zoom wheel to zoom the drone lens. Turn the adjustment roller of the pan tilt to achieve the up and down adjustment of the drone pan tilt. Press the 
the photo taking button on the APP to take a one-click photo. Press the camera function button, select the shutter button to start recording, and then press the shutter button again to save the video. Remove the SD card of the drone, insert the remote control, and you can view photos and videos. the album button of the APP to enter and view the photos taken. Select the video album to view the recorded videos. Press the back key to return to the image transmission interface. Long press the obstacle avoidance button to activate the obstacle avoidance mode of the drone. When controlling the drone to fly forward, backward, left and right, scan for obstacles and stop it. Press the airdrop button of the drone to hang the airdrop. airdrop button on the APP to achieve the airdrop function. The drone is set to low speed by default when activated. Press the speed switch button to beep beep sounds indicate medium speed. Press the speed switch button three beep beep sounds indicate the high speed mode. Press the return button and the drone will enter the intelligent return mode. Indoor flight. Press the GPS button and the GPS will switch to indoor flight mode. The headlights remain on for a long time and the rear lights flash slowly and then remain on for a long time. This is the indoor flight mode. Press the one key gyroscope correction button briefly and the remote control will beep. Front and rear lights flash and remain bright for a long time. The calibration is successful. Use the outer eight joysticks, unlock the motor, and push the joystick up to take off the drone. Indoor optical flow positioning. Replace the fan blades as a screwdriver to unscrew the screws and remove the old fan blades. Attention to distinguishing the arms A and B from the fan blades A and B. Install the corresponding fan blades on the corresponding arms and complete the